Hi everyone. So today I have done a glittery bright blue graphic eyeliner look for New Year's Eve and I paired it with nude pink lips and if you like to know how I created this then please keep watching. So first of all the eye base and this is from Maybelline the color tattoo and I'm just applying it over the lids and a little bit on the crease area and on the outer sides. And here is the eyeliner and that's from NYX. That's a nice matte eyeliner. So first of all I'm going to create a wing. Just like this. Take your time and make small strokes and do it uh, like you don't have to be in hurry. And now a line all the way to the inner side not exactly to the inner corners but yeah quite uh, towards inside and you just have to make sure that the eyeliner you are making it should not be too up to the crease and not uh, too down to your lids it has to be according to the shape of your eye so here i'm making the winged eyeliner and i'm going to i'm going to fill it now So just slowly you have to do it by taking your time and this is the color tattoo to make a nice base that's in black color and it's from Kiko. So I'm gonna fill it this uh, graphic eyeliner that I have made. You just have to be careful so it won't get smudgy and sure I'm using a, a small brush just to make sure that it's even everywhere. And now this uh, blue eyeshadow that's from Makeup Revolution so I'm gonna apply it with the help of uh, the pencil brush. And to make sure it's nice and clean and not smudgy at all you have to be just a bit slowly and steadily make like a layer. And here is uh, the glue and that's the glitter that I'm gonna use so they are by NYX so first of all the glitter and I'm gonna apply it in the middle area and a little bit here and there so a bit to the wider area it gonna cover and with the help of a clean finger I'm just gonna dab in the glitters so once I'm done with it I have taken the eyeliner once again and small strokes and again the a thin eyeliner I'm gonna make and I'm overdoing it just a little bit only to make sure that it's nice and clean and not smudgy at all and here is the mascara and the only thing you have to keep in mind that you make sure you do it uh, according to the shape of your eye so here is uh, that's a color tattoo by Maybelline for my inner corners and a little bit on the lower lash line. So now here is the foundation and that's from Bourjois. That's a Bourjois Healthy Mix. And now the concealer. So applying only in the underneath my eye. And here I'm gonna set it with the help of, uh, that's a compact. That's also from Bourjois, so applying it all over my face. And now the color correction. I have taken the green color to hide my brown spots. And I have made a, a whole video about how to do your base makeup. So you can check that out to get to know about the color correction and how to apply the foundation, concealer, all that. So you can check that out. So I'm going to set it with uh, the compact. And now here is the contouring. So I've taken a fluffy brush and uh, contouring my nose. And a little bit contouring my cheeks. Applying to the hollow of my cheeks. On my other cheek as well. 
and here is uh, the blusher that's from makeup revolution and that's a nice bright pink kind of blush and that's a highlighter that's also from Maybelline studio sculpt so a little bit over the nose and here is the lip pencil that's from Kiko that's a nice orangey kind of nude shade and that's a pink lipstick from Milani that's a nice liquid lipstick quite cool toned so the both of them goes well together and here I'm gonna highlight my cheeks just a little bit not too much just to get a nice and beautiful kind of finish a little bit on my nose and a little bit on the cupid bone as well so that's uh, the final look dear and uh, hope you guys gonna like it and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and I hope that uh, you guys find me on Instagram and Facebook so thank you very much and a happy new year to everyone.